Okay, welcome back to Full Self Driving Beta Testing. This is very likely the last video you're going to see of 8.2 because version 9 is supposedly dropping at midnight tonight, uh, at least for the current beta testers. So this is going to be hopefully kind of a short video. Uh, I'm trying to capture an unprotected left turn that I've gone through many times and it's been extremely good uh, with heavy cross traffic from both the left and the right. So I have just a little bit of stretch here uh, to go to kind of set this up. Um, so we have cross tra traffic from the left and right, and it's gonna be an unprotected left turn across that traffic. I've done this intersection uh, a number of times, and I've been absolutely blown away with how the car waits and then finds the gap and goes for it. Uh, the only negative is sometimes it's not quite aggressive enough on the accelerator to actually uh, commit through to it. Uh, if there is kind of a, a, a close situation. But we'll see how it does today. Uh, it looks like I have no one behind me, so we can kind of take our time here and wait for a gap. Uh, but like I said, from past experiences, for some reason this particular T intersection up here has been uh, phenomenal. Uh, and there is typically a lot of traffic. It's about 10 o'clock in the morning. So uh, we'll see if there's uh, sufficient cross traffic. Now I'll, I'll make a few laps to go through here just in case uh, we don't have any like a, a good setup on this first one. So I don't have a 360 camera so I'll give you a little bit of a play-by-play -play here uh, but pretty typical intersection here. Uh, from the left it's actually clear but from the right we do have traffic. Okay so we are stopped. It's still clear on the left. On the right we have about 10 more cars to go. Uh, on the left there is a, a truck about a quarter of a mile coming. It's going to be clear the next car after this one. So right now it's clear and we go. No accelerator input. That was great. Uh, we were only dealing with traffic just from the right that time. Uh, nothing from the left. So uh, I'm going to manually disengage and do that again. Uh, I'm, I'll just do it uncut. It makes my video editing easier. You can fast forward until uh, I do this maneuver again, but I'll just manually kind of drive this thing and set myself up to try this again. Yeah, uh, super excited about beta um, 9 coming out. Let's get this set up here. Yeah, so Beta 9, uh, suppose it's coming out at midnight Pacific time, uh, maybe on like an automatic schedule. So I'm in the central time zone, so that'd be 2 o'clock in the morning my time, and I know it's going to be difficult to uh, to sleep, um, but we'll see, uh, we'll see if that truly does come out or not. There's some cyclists down the road there. I'm trying to think if I should interact with them somehow. I think I'll let them get in front of me and then I will go behind them. And this is not exactly what I wanted here. I should just route. Okay, perfect. That's what we want. I'm going to let these cyclists get in front of me. One, so they're not waiting on me, and two, so they can be in front of me and we can see how Beta interacts with them. So just kind of bear with me here. They're not going super fast, but they are probably about 30 seconds out. Uh, let's see if we can uh, figure out when the, the system picks them up. So they're clearly in sight to me. They're over here somewhere. No one behind me right now. Okay, they're clearly in sight, only about 30 yards away. Mm, interesting. They're in f okay, so they were never displayed. Gosh. Well, there's gonna be a car behind me now. Okay, there they are. Okay, full stuff drives turned on. Of course, I'm super, super cautious. Always, but especially when there's pedestrians. Uh, we see them both in dark green, which typically means we're following them. They're unclipping to prepare for this stop. 
We have our left turn signal on. We're safely behind them. They are picking their opportunity. Of course, it's clear. I have a car behind me. Traffic from the left. One car from the left. We're kind of creeping, which is a little bit uncomfortable for them, probably. It's clear now. So we go. Okay. Uh, really good timing. I'm just waiting for more traffic. So I'm going to do a few more laps here until we get some more traffic um, to make this a better test. I'll take this first turn here just to shorten up my interval. I thought that was very good with the cyclists, though. Um, we were very safe with them. Interesting they weren't depicted uh, when they were crossed in front of us. Perhaps if I had uh, autopilot turned on, maybe they would have been depicted then. Sometimes it's funny how this thing filters out what it displays and what it does not display. So I don't, I don't, I don't take something being displayed on here or not being displayed on here as the ground truth of what the system is seeing because it does filter things out in some undeterminable way. Okay, so once again, it routed us kind of goofy here. I think it will reroute once I get on this road. No traffic behind us. Let's let it reroute. Okay, there it rerouted. Okay, we'll try this again. Let's see how the traffic's looking. So, there's going to be a slug of cars coming from the right here in a little bit. It's clear left. It's clear now. If we go, it's, it's clear now. And we're going. Okay, so that was fine. What I'm really trying to do is I'm trying to find heavy traffic. Um, maybe lunchtime around like 12 o'clock, 1230. I might have more traffic for people, you know, taking a late lunch and then people coming back from an early lunch. So. Yeah, but I'm really just trying to find some heavy traffic because I've seen it. I've seen it before where there's a lot of traffic from the left and right. And it's just been on point, really. And remember, this is version 8.2. Version 9 hopefully will have some improvements in a lot of areas. Okay, I think this is attempt number four. Okay, we have some cars. Okay, cool. We have cars from the right lined up. A good number of cars. We have a good number. Of, okay, this is a good setup. So we have cars from the left. Try to show it on here too. I'm not sure how well the camera picks that up. So it's now after this car, clear to the left, but we have traffic from the right. So we're waiting. It's still clear to the left. We have some cars to the right. Um. To the left, there's a car way down there. If it were me, I would start creeping about now, but it's going to be clear after this Prius, and we go. No inputs on the accelerator. So very good timing. The only difference is if I were driving, I probably would have started creeping forward a little bit sooner um, because it was clear. So that was a good setup, and that's pretty close to what I've been seeing, uh, although I've seen some even a little bit more difficult than that where it's been just fine. Um, so let's do this a few more times. Um, that was a good good uh, example. Um, I really wish I had a 360 camera or something that could uh, show better the exact situation. Maybe I can make this a little bit quicker if I reverse. Okay, unfortunately it's clear to the right and clear to the left, so it's perfectly clear. Come to a stop and we go.
Okay, these cyclists are coming back. Uh, let me... They're off to the side there. I'm just trying to figure if there's anything I can do to uh, see how we interact with them. Actually, let me zip across here. Kind of a goofy route there. So I'm just manually driving now because my destination is not correct. I always forget how quick this car is. It's a rear wheel drive long range. I drive super cautiously when I drive manually, which is probably why I was accepted in the beta program because my telemetry stats or whatever they looked at were probably exceptionally safe, I would imagine. I almost never really get on the throttle very much. Okay, let's make this the last time, um, no matter what happens here. Um, the whole point of this video is to show uh, unprotected lefts, and I've had exceptionally good luck, specifically at this intersection. So yeah, not a lot of traffic right now. We do have some from the left, so we'll have to wait for these guys on the left here. About four cars at least stacked up, and it looks like it's going to be clear to the right also once this traffic's gone. White car. One more after this one, and it will be clear now to go. Very reasonable. Uh, I think an impatient driver behind you might give you a little honk there, but it was totally reasonable. And if someone did honk at you, they're just having a bad day because that was not unreasonable at all. Anyway, version 9 hopefully dropping tonight. Super excited. Uh, honestly, I'll probably wake up and... Uh, get that installed on the road by 2.30 or 3 if things happen like Elon Musk says they will, which who knows, right? So anyway, another video in, uh, in the morning, hopefully.